Thank you for watching, liking, commenting, sharing, and subscribing right now. What's on your screen right now? I mean, aside from this video, which assumedly is on your screen unless you're just listening to it. You probably have other things on your desktop there. You ever heard of screencasting? That's uh, taking a uh, recording of whatever happens to be on your screen and then pushing it out to the web. Usually uh, it's done in conjunction with audio, assuming your computer has audio. And there are a lot of people out there who, who can screencast, but for some reason or another, their computer doesn't have a microphone and they're too cheap to like buy one. I've seen a lot of those on YouTube. No matter if you're interested in getting into screencasting and specifically tying it into your Twitter account, you may be interested in this particular web service. It's free and it doesn't require any software installation aside from Adobe's Flash, which unfortunately in its current state sucks. As evidenced by my browser lockup just a few minutes ago, uh, because it just, I got the spinning beach ball of doom right in the middle, zoomed in and everything. I could have screencast it if only it wasn't the browser that was frozen. So head over to screenjelly.com and uh, it's going to ask you what's on your screen. And well, you don't have to answer that question. You simply only have to press the record button. It says recorder is loading. I'll zoom out again. Eh, waiting for the recorder to load. Oh, hey, look at this. It's recording. It's taking audio from my Logitech webcam. Although I got to tell you, uh, the audio quality on Screen Jelly uh, recordings seems to be bleh right now. But that's not the point. The point is, is I can click a button, do something on my screen for three minutes or so, press stop, and then tweet out a link to that particular screencast. How is this useful? Well, uh, let's say, just for argument's sake, you've got uh, a family member um, who's at a computer on the other side of the world, and you, you don't have any way of getting into their desktop. You have no way of sharing their desktop, and you, you don't even want to mess with software installation. You say, can you just show me, can you just go here, press this button, click here, and then do this? It'll be so much easier to facilitate an uploading of a screencast that way than trying to uh, have them install software and, and go through that entire routine. A simple way of, uh, you know, screencasting. That's kind of the point. The only problem I see with it right now is that I can't really adjust the quality uh, and I, I can't share to YouTube. So a couple of downfalls at this point, uh, but, you know, hopefully Screen Jelly will continue to improve. Uh, with time, I would say that the addition, wouldn't you guys want that? Wouldn't you want this to push to YouTube? If so, you may want to uh, drop the developer's line. Oh, I better stop. Okay, stop. It asked me if I want to see, uh, you know, what I've done here. The recorder oh, hey, look at this, it's recording. It's oh, that, that was bad. See, you heard of the audio, it's like, ugh. you can't really adjust it. Of course, I'd probably blame Logitech for, you know, the hardware not being perfect, but I can't adjust the settings at all, at least on this end. I can't get a good audio preview. So they've got some stuff to work on, but still, it's a step in the right direction. Screenjelly.com. Give it a shot. Tweet it out. My email address is chris at perillo.com. If you have any other resources to pass along, I, I might be interested in taking a look, possibly sharing with the rest of the community. Which community? I'm glad you asked even if you didn't ask. It's at geeks.perillo.com. And of course, we've also got a chat room, typically talking tech, 24 hours a day, seven days a week. Let me try that again. Did, did that make sense? I said days. It's a little, there's sometimes there's, you know, an extra syllable in days, especially when you've had too much coffee for the, the day. Anyway, we're right here at live.perillo.com. We'll see you later.